close. Promise me you won't kill him, okay? I make no promises, but I will try not to kill the beast. Notch in the wall. Your plan. I'm sort of making it up as I go. But you're not talking about Varm. You cannot outsmart Odin. It's worked so far. Has it? Now what? I'm gonna try to tame it. Tame it? Sure. I've tamed wolves before. I'll just track on. You freeze this chains with your axe so we can't run and latch them onto something. No, too dangerous. It's a good plan. Let's move. Wait. transformation. Did Odin teach you to control it? No. We will not rely on what he taught you. Next time, we do it my way. Yes, sir. Ah! 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 
up on purpose, did you? No, who does not trust? Sorry, that wasn't fair. I thought it was work. Patience. We will find a way. I think we need to get up to that ledge up there. But how? There is always a way. Do you see? Oh, why didn't I think of that? The solution is not always obvious. Above you, father! <laughs> My arrows will slow her down! It means what you think it means. But can't we try and... We have the power to limit the harm this creature can cause. We will use it. Okay. Our 
you tired of destroying things? I wish it didn't have to end that way. It's my fault he got loose. That he's dead. Sometimes there is no other way. I know. Just go home now. Atreus. I know. Close my heart to it. <sighs> Another locked door. <laughs> gonna stay open. The gear's behind that gate. There's gotta be a way to freeze it, right? to carry the frost to the gear.
thought you didn't believe in that. Find him. The dead will keep flooding the realms. The realms will collapse. You must learn to calm your mind. Maybe I've learned I run better on chaos. What else did you learn? We work better when we trust each other. <laughs> you hear that? Where is he? <laughs> Now! Ah! 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 Ah!
Please work, please work! I'm sorry! What happened? We gotta find him. Come on. Well, if he came this way, let's find another way up. What did you do? At the house. The spell you saw me do in Fenrir died. I didn't know it then, but I accidentally put his soul into my knife. Souls are powerful, so I thought maybe Fenrir's could... Change its nature. Yeah, let's see if it took. When I found you in Midgard, before Freya attacked, you said you needed to protect me. Why? I saw a prophecy. You were... in my arms. Dead. I saw it too. In Jotunheim. What? You knew? That's why you've been training me so hard. One day, you will have to survive without me. Not gonna happen. I won't let it. I won't. Our journey's come to an end. Not ours. Not like that. It's over now. I promise. Fen? Are you? you too. Didn't know if that would work. We did it. Sit. How is this possible? It's giant magic. I've been learning things. In Asgard. This has nothing to do with that. More secrets? No. A promise. Even that someone's trusting me to keep. Like you kept your promise to Mom? See what I can do when you trust me? But that's not who you are anymore, right? A god killer? You don't want war. No, but I will do what it takes to keep you safe.
it's open. Maybe we can use the sigils to freeze the gear up there. Father, if you can't trust the fates, why do you care what they say? If it comes to your life, I can take no chances. Look here. Mr. Gateway got buried. I have it. <laughs> What's wrong? Without you, I got reckless, overconfident, made stupid mistakes. I don't know why I thought I could do this alone. You were right. No. On our journey together, you have grown into a warrior, worthy of your namesake. I was the one who was not ready. You don't have to be who you were just because I'm not there. Let's make a promise. I'll listen for your voice in my head when you're not there to guide me. And you do the same, All right? I need to know you'll be okay without me. Don't be sorry, Father. Be better. 
Let's go home. Nothing is written. That can't be unwritten. Remember? We shouldn't let prophecy define our choices. We will make our own destiny. Did you want to take care of anything before going back to Sindri's? No. First, we retrieve Mamir. Then you can tell us what you learned in Asgard. After that, we shall see. You really do think of him as a brother. What about Freya? Seems like she moved in while I was away. Once she turned her hatred back to Odin, she recognized our interests were alive. Huh. I tried convincing her of that, but... When was that? Oh. Before I started telling you where I was that night. I see. Hey, she didn't kill me. I said nothing. You're back. How did it go? We should trouble us no further. Well, that's a bloody relief. So you put down old Garm, did you? Yeah. Sort of. Atreus, your decision to go to Asgard after all he's put us through. I'll never understand it. But I hope you at least came back with something we can use. I hope so, too. Come on. Let me show you what Odin's up to. Here's what he cares about most. More than Ragnarok or anything, is this mask. Anyone recognize it? That thing? Ugh, oh, it's a dead end. He's been faffing around with that since before I knew him. To be honest, I thought the giants were just having a laugh with that one. Okay, fine. No. You're wrong, Mimir. This mask is no fraud. The giants didn't make it, and only a few of them ever glimpsed it in their visions. They never knew its origin, but some believed it was a way to gaze into the secrets of creation itself. Is it an oracle? Much, much more. Imagine becoming one with a source of infinite knowledge. This? This is why Odin tortured me. So what do you think? Know it? No. It's one obsession he never saw fit to share with me. But I'll tell you this. Even when Odin speaks the truth, his purpose is false. Either way, it's a mistake to let it distract us. Is Heimdall our focus or not? We will rewrite our fate another way. Then I'm going back to Vanaheim. If we're not taking the fight to Odin, I should help my brother stand against him. We will join her when we can. I'm gonna study my notes on the mask, see if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, I'm with you. And listen, everyone, I'm really sorry about the way I left. You know I've never hurt any of you on purpose. Well, when you can turn into a bear by accident, I suppose these things can happen. So, do you forgive me? Of course, Atreus. We know you meant no harm, lad. Sindri? 
I'm sure I will. Eventually. Okay. Guess I'll take it. <laughs>